throughout last year, 2015, uh, Dr. Parik was in touch with me constantly. She used to, after we went through the procedure, she used to give me co constant updates about the, the child to be born and guided me through and through what I needed to do. And then when the baby was born, we discussed a lot about how are we going to bring this child to the world? It's, uh, it's a new, unconventional way that I have chosen. And she was very, very, very encouraging, very, made me feel very confident that uh, I should go all out and tell the world that this is how I've done it and this is going to be the family that I've chosen. My, my own parents were a bit, they were a bit apprehensive whether I, should have, whether, whether I should announce the child to be one born through IVF and surrogacy or not because they were like, uh, you don't know how it's going to be in India, how it's going to be taken in India, and why even announce it? You know, why don't you just tell friends and let friends tell more friends, and that's how it should spread, and that's, that's how, announce mat kar, kyu announce karna, ye wo, ye wo, ye wo. But she, uh, she was the one who encouraged me to uh, make a statement, and she said that, you know, it's your right to tell the world, it's nobody else's right, and you should be the one to uh, be as honest as possible, and Gossip really goes down when you're very forthright, when you're clear, when you're confident, when you tell the world what's, what's done and how it's done and the honesty behind it makes things uh, more acceptable. So I think she was right. Of course, uh, most, mostly she's always been right. And in fact, I think today is the day when we all should uh, acknowledge that she's always been right. And in my case, it was very right because uh, all of you, the people here, the people in our country, the media, everybody has been very positive, very accepting. And that was also a bit, uh, bit of a surprise for me because I thought there'd be diverse views, there'd be, there'd be some kind of uh, ooh and ahs about it, there'd be all kinds of opinions and probably a Pandora box would open up and there'd be all kinds of things coming up, but nothing of that sort happened because I think the country, the, the people, Everyone has been very expect accepting, especially the media has been so supportive of Lakshya and uh, my um, choice of having a family in this manner. So I'm thankful to everyone here, everyone in the country, everyone in the media for being amazing, being, being India as it is and as it really is. Thank you so much. What was the first thing that you know, came into your mind while thinking of being a single parent? You know, that's really tough when it comes to India. नहीं एक दो साल से मतलब दो तीन साल से मैं सोच रहा था कि करना है मुझे कहाँ क्या अमेरिका जाना पड़ेगा यहाँ होता है भी कि नहीं all these kind of thoughts would come and I was talk I used to talk to my girlfriends also like Amrita and people like you know Neelam Neelam से मैं बात करता था they used to all give me vague answers ऐसा बोलते थे कि apparently the laws are better in India then I happened to meet Dr. Firuza Parekh and सब sort out हो गया but the first thought, I mean, when the baby came home was कि हम announce कैसे करेंगे वो सबसे मतलब कि when you don't have a wife and you've not gone the normal conventional way, I won't say it's normal or not normal. Everything is normal, but when you when you haven't gone the conventional way, then you don't want you know speculation to come about कि ये मतलब कैसे आया बच्चा ये वो ये वो तो I I'm grateful to her for guiding me in the right way that you know we'll announce it at the right time and we'll announce it with honesty and with whatever we've done in the hospital in that manner. So that is, I think, uh, something that worked out as far as, you know, the societal acceptance is concerned. But in my mind, just father to become a father, what will happen to father? I hope that the road is open for those who want to be a single parenthood option and they still want to be parents and have kids. And uh, it was not my first option. I'm 40 right now, and I came to uh, I came to realize कि ये रास्ता मुझे चाहिए, and it's turned out to be a beautiful option for me thanks to Dr. Firuza Parik and the technology and the services and the team at Just Look. I want to thank you all all also. It's God sent for me क्योंकि मैं तिरुपति गया था वहाँ प्रकाश झा जी से मुलाकात हुई जिन्होंने मुझे वहाँ ड्राइव पर एक फैमिली से बात करवाई फोन पे जिन्होंने ये जिन्होंने ये प्रोसीजर किया है उन्होंने मुझे फिरोजा पारिक जी से मिलवाया एंड वी वर जस्ट टॉकिंग अबाउट इन दी एलिवेटर अभी कि पता ही नहीं चला कि एक साल कहाँ चला गया और अभी एक बेबी मेरे घर पे जो मेरा वेट कर रहा है मेरा बेटा मैं जाऊँगा और उससे मतलब उसके साथ खेलूँगा तो आई थिंक ये चीज़ें प्लान ही की जा सकती आई एम ग्रेटफुल टू गॉड ऑल्सो फॉर ब्लेसिंग मी विथ अच्छा with such good people and uh, with my son, Laksh Kapoor. So, and thank you to all of you.